Frankie Lee Singleton, uh, Bosa's mate, second class. What I learned is I love my country. And, uh, you know, just, uh, just, you know, if you want something, you just set your, set your uh, uh, future and work hard for it. You know, people expect everybody to give them stuff. Man, that's, that's not how our country was built. And uh, if you work hard, just like in the Navy, you know, I need to keep my mouth shut and do what I was told. And I, I was lucky uh, because I was able to make uh, an E-5, which is a second class, uh, well, I was a bosun's mate. Uh, but the reason I did that because the higher rate you had, the more money you made. And so that's, that's what I did. I worked to, to make more money uh, and to, to have something in life. And, and the Navy taught me well. But you, you're on your own, you know. You, as my mother used to tell me, you make your bed hard, you have to lay in it, uh, mm -hmm. you know. And, and it, it, that that has worked well for me. And I I've seen you know people working you know to make rate, and uh, you know it was good. You know I I loved it. Of course I was glad to get out. You know I just uh, I I'd seen the world and I was ready to get out. I had a brother that was younger, he's seven years younger than me, and he, he made a career of the Air Force. So, and it, and it, it's been good for him. Well, I went to school for a month, and I, I had a job before I went in the service. I went back to them, but eventually I got to, uh, my father-in-law in California had a shoe business, and uh, they wanted their, <laughs> their daughter back home. So he uh, uh, asked me to meet him in Texas and gave me a spill about, being in business and uh, coming out and working for him and uh, maybe you know later on in life we could establish our own business and that's what I did and we went back to California although my wife worked for him and I was lucky enough to uh, get a, a, a job being a salesman and uh, I did that and then the company that I worked for which was United Technologies had owned the company I sold wire and cable 600 volt wire and cable uh, I got transferred back to Tennessee, so it worked out well.